Hey everyone, Rob Rendered here. I'm going to be talking about um, how fear and worry um, has an effect on the immune system. So, uh, what we can do about that? And um, I'm uh, I was in Cuba until a couple of days ago. Uh, it just it, it it it's not a good place for Airbnb. There's no food. Internet connection was just so bad. It was incredible. So I had to get out of the country, and it was really difficult to change my flight you know with every you know airline companies being inundated with refunds and everything so it got a bit scary we um i'm now down in um in mexico on the coast there's the sea in the background and it's really lovely and warm here uh we we um, i'm working online you know i have my clients all over the world so um i can continue working which is great i'm very grateful for that um you know, we, we're focused on exercise and we did our exercise this morning uh, all together as a family and uh, getting good, healthy food and and um, uh, just we're not, uh, we wanted to be away from all the fear and the social media and this constant uh, pounding uh, on the mind of, of these worst case scenarios. Um, so I, that was kind of a decision that I wanted to be somewhere where I was just kind of having a detox from that. But I understand that that's a kind of privilege that um, I, I, you know, I spent, this was like 15 years ago, I, I put into place a plan to be able to work online and not have to be anywhere. So that, uh, and if, funny enough, I get a lot of people, clients now working with me to be able to do that themselves and uh, you know remove their limiting beliefs that are holding them back and their fears around uh, you know changing careers and stuff um and uh i don't know if you know this but i have i do have a course online that you could start today um where i teach you how to do what i do and you know there's um i have students on the course who are really seriously considering now actually doing it as a career move uh, working online and being able to help people all over the world and get paid very well to doing for doing it so uh, if you're stuck at home and you're reconsidering um, you know what you want to do with your life uh, I have a course which in eight weeks brings you up to um, being able to do this method it you're not going to be you know I, I don't say in eight weeks time you'll be as good as me um, because I've been doing it for years, but you'll be good enough to be able to start working on people straight away. And then it's just a question of experience. But I have clients already, uh, students online who are uh, working on other people. So, uh, all of, you know, in, in their own countries. So if you're interested in knowing more about that, please reply back to this email or get in touch with me at support at And, um, I will, uh, get straight back to you and let you know if uh, you're, you're a good fit for the course. Um, so just coming back to this, uh, you know, external energy of fear and worry, um, it's a, it's uh, infectious, the fear, it, it, it's compounding. So um, that is extremely harmful for the uh, nervous system. So I've got someone keeps uh, messaging me. Um, it's extremely harmful for the uh, immune system so uh, it doesn't mean that we we have no fear in life of course there's always fear is useful and it enables us to take precautions um, and there are things that we could be doing right now you know washing hands uh, self-quarantine staying away from people etc but the this constant feeding of fear and and it it kind of lather, lathers up and f becomes a frenzy that has a negative effect and the way we perceive a situation um, it affects our hormonal system, it affects our immune system. So the perception of the situation has a real direct impact on our health. And when the when we start getting beaten down by fear, that starts to beat down our immune system. That's just a fact. So what can you do about that? Well, um, you can question your thoughts and there's different ways to do that. Uh, Byron Katie's stuff online, you can check that out. It's free, you just learn. Uh, I used to do that a lot, is learn how to question my thoughts that uh, create the pain and create the worries and everything. It's our thoughts. And therefore, that has a cascading effect on our 
uh, central nervous system autoimmune system so her stuff's free yeah the way i work i've kind of i went through that um her stuff and then i developed my own way of working um and so when a client comes to see me uh so let's say you book a call with me we'll go um we'll connect either on whatsapp facetime or skype or something like that and then you you would tell me everything you're worried about like i'm worried about my mom i'm I'm concerned about the future of finances and everything. And we just take each thought that's painful to you and we find the underlying weakness to it. Now, the might, you might be thinking, well, what would that do to it? Well, you've got to experience it because um, you find the underlying weakness and strengthen it. It changes completely, instantly changes your perception of the situation. I've done it, you know, millions of times, uh, you know, this setting this baseline that's painful and then afterwards it doesn't bother people. Um, so what you at the end of the session if all your worries and fears around whatever they might be let's say coronavirus then you'll be feeling much lighter and, and not stressed about it and that in turn will uh, have a massive effect on f your physiology and autoimmune system so whichever way you do you've got to question your mind you've got to find the truth behind the statement whenever you believe something that's not true it creates uh, discomfort, emo negative emotions, etc. Um, so yeah, so kind of two things with this is one, you need to be, uh, just don't keep feeding the fear from the social media and the media. That's what drives content. That's what drives their business is fear. So kind of, you know what to do now. You don't need to be kind of filling up on that every day. Question your mind. You've got lots of time now stuck at home. Uh, you can work on your mind, start questioning it. Byron Katie's stuff's really good. Or you book a session with me, we jump on and we, it's really, really working with me is kind of more effective so you don't have to learn a whole new system. And then if you're interested in, um, you know, learning how to do what I do, uh, learning how to resolve things for your family, for yourself, uh, learning how to quiet your monkey mind, learning how to how every we're all connected and how you can tap into that so that you reach your potential and you clear anything that's holding you back. I have an online course that uh, explains that and you just get in touch with me um, and you could be starting that whole new journey in life. Um, you know, as, as from reading, from listening to this, uh, you can be uh, starting the course anywhere in the world. You can be watching it on your iPhone and getting stuck in. So you can make a change today. Only thing stopping you is yourself. Listen, um, take care wherever you may be. And um, thanks for listening. And I will talk to you all soon. Take care.